Hello friends, welcome back to the channel. A brand new legendary terror raid event has been announced for Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. We're going to cover all of the details in today's video as well as some Pokemon you can take into these raids to beat them with and get them easily in your games. So again, at the end of the latest Indigo Disc trailer, we had the announcement of the next Terror Raid event that will be happening in Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. And this time will be for two legendary Pokemon featuring Dialga and Palkia. They will be coming to the games later today as of recording this on the 7th of December. So prepare for battles of Paldean proportions when Dialga and Palkia appear in five star Terror Raid battles. So these will be five star Terror Raids. They won't be seven star Terror Raids. They won't be as powerful as we'd normally see these terror raid events so not too difficult to take down you'll be able to take on these legendary pokemon from thursday the 7th of december at 4 p.m pst which translates into about midnight utc which is about 9 p.m eastern time as well dialga will be appearing in pokemon scarlet so that'll be exclusive to scarlet players whereas Palkia will be exclusive to Pokemon Violet. So you will be able to go online if you've got an online subscription and access other raids that players are hosting for the opposite version that you don't have in your copy to get both of them in one game. And it does outline that you can only catch Dialga and Palkia once per save file. So you can't catch multiple of these, which makes kind of sense but you can keep challenging them to obtain more rewards after you've caught them. So hoping the reward drops for these two Pokemon will be good. You'll be able to find the five-star Terror Raid battles after completing Pokemon Scarlet and Violet's main story. However, players who haven't completed the main story may still participate in Terror Raid battles by joining other trainers in multiplayer. So even if you haven't finished the game, you'll be able to access these online. You can participate in Terror Raid battles against Pokemon that won't appear in the version of your game you're playing by joining terror raid battles hosted by a trainer with the opposite version of the game like we've just outlined but you do need the paid online membership to be able to do this but both of these pokemon look as though they will be dragon types their terror typing will be dragon we don't know much information other than that as of yet but the events will be going live later today like i say and we will be streaming the terror raid events here live on the channel so if you've got a copy of violet and you want to be able to grab a copy of dialga i will be hosting them tonight and i will try and do it on my violet as well for those of you that have scarlet so you can grab Palkia and we'll be able to do these and run through them pretty easy like I say they are five star raids now I have prepared some builds in game just going into these I don't know if they're going to be useful but obviously we'll find out when the raids go live but two Pokemon that come to mind straight away are Fluttermane and Azumarill Azumarill in particular because it has got that fairy and water typing it will be neutral or at least taking neutral hits from Dialga because it is going to have access to those steel type attacks being part steel and dragon. It's probably likely going to have flash cannon. Um, it doesn't have any way to kind of boost its moves. So that's something to kind of not worry about too much. But we went for the fairy terror typing on this shell bell as the held item. And being a five star raid, I feel like you can get away with a belly drum set. Maybe not so much online, but soloing in your game, you should be fine. Move set that we went for is Misty Terrain, Belly Drum, Light Screen, and Play Rough Light Screen. It's going to give you a bit more of a buffer against those special attacking moves that you're going to see from Dialga. Very straightforward EV spread of 252 HP, 252 in attack with an adamant nature, and the ability is huge power. Basic premise is going to be turn one, get your light screen up, then turn two, belly drum, and then just start spamming play roughs as well. So until you can terrestrialize. And I, as I say, these are five star raids. I don't expect these to be too difficult, but this is just something that a lot of you probably already have in your games that can be useful and will be good against both the Palkia and the Dialga. The only thing that you're going to have to watch out from the Dialga's point of view is going to be Thunder or Thunderbolt that it potentially could have access to. The other option that I do feel like will be quite good in this raid is going to be Fluttermane. It is going to be able to outspeed both of these Terror Raid bosses, so no problem on that front. It is going to have the Shell Bell as a held item. You can even put the Expert Bell on this if you would prefer to. We've got the Fairy Terror Typing. And the moveset is going to be Calm Mind, Fake Tears, Shadow Ball, and Draining Kiss. Protosynthesis is the ability, and the EV spread is 252 HP, 252 Special Attack with a Modest Nature. The basic idea behind this set is going to be because you can outspeed both the Dialga and the Palkia, get a Calm Mind up turn one. That is going to make sure that you can take those threatening steel type attacks from the Dialga, in particular if you're taking this in. But I think after a couple of Calm Minds, you're going to be in a really good position where you're able to just take those attacks very easily 
Utilize fake tears before the shield goes up to lower the special defense on the target Pokemon and then just start spamming draining kiss, especially after you terrestrialize. You'll be recovering health as well as doing a good sizable damage. So these are two builds, like I say, that will feature in today's video. We'll see if they do work when the raid goes live later today. Of course, we will be streaming it, like I've said. So we will soon find out on that front. But that is all of the information and everything that I wanted to cover in today's video. Very exciting that we are getting legendary Pokemon that are coming to the games in Terror Raids, in particular Dialga and Palkia. Let me know down in the comment section which one you prefer, you Team Dialga or Team Palkia. I've got to probably say I'm probably Team Dialga on this one. I do like Palkia, but Dialga is just a little bit cooler. So looking forward to getting both of these in the game later and being able to catch them. And I uh, hope you are too. If you are around for the stream, do drop by. We'll be going through them and doing them online. So we'll be sharing the raids with those who want the opposite version from the copy that they've got. And uh, it'll be a lot of fun. So hopefully you'll see you then. Hopefully you have a lot of fun taking part in this event. It is running for a long period of time. A week after the Indigo Disc drop. So a long time to take advantage of this one in Scarlet and Violet. Have a great rest of your day though friends. If you found today's video useful. Please do consider dropping a like. Do subscribe to the channel to stay up to date with all of our Pokemon Scarlet and Violet content. And I will see you all in another video very soon. Until then take care of yourselves. And bye bye.